I'm cleansed. I'm cleansed very then, much. I feel like if y'all should just stop having sex. I'm in outside of marriage. Just stop. Because you're going to have a baby and you're not going to have money for diapers. I remember one other thing. <laughs> and when our camera thing. guy checked out. No, the no, no. Man just no, no. Because, like, like for, this is the real thing that actually much? happened. No, seriously. Like, stop having sex. Stop it. Stop it. Just stop. <laughs> Honestly, this is just. No. Hey. If you all of the whole the whole Maserati just whole signed thing. off. I'm They're telling like, you. They're lo- like, log out. This is, this lo- <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> no. So what? They log out? Welcome to another episode of Queasy and Friends. And today we're bringing you nothing but great content. And I should say, man, thank you so much to all the love that you show on social media and all the followers and, you know, just you guys watching. It always means a great deal. And for that, we absolutely appreciate. And today, as usual, we are at the clan guest house. You know, standard procedure. Uh, they are treating us nice. Obviously, you can go check out the social media platforms for all of the offers they have in terms of the accommodation, the food, the drinks, everything, including the coffee. Speaking of which, this morning, I guess, <laughs> we are with Tamia. We're going to share coffee while we do a lot of other great things together. Hi. How are you doing, my love? I'm okay. How are you? Thank you. I am so amazing. Thank you for being here. Thank you for inviting me. Have I been with you on TV, though? Like, I think we've done radio a lot. Too much of radio. Yeah, not it's TV. It's been a lot of... <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's been a lot of radio. This is the first time people actually see us, like, um, on television. Yeah. Or, yeah, yeah. Chilling Visually, and talking. Yeah. Listen, we're going to talk about a lot. Okay. Uh, we'll talk about the childhood. We'll talk about um, you in music. Mm. We'll talk about relationships. Mm. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk about literally everything. Mm. So let's start mm. off with your childhood, yeah? Yeah. Um, growing up, where, where are you growing up? Are you growing up in Lesotho? Or were you raised in South Africa? Mm. Or abroad? Why would you think that? Why would you? Why? 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 Because, okay. Because, yeah, I'm curious. Why would you think? Because your surname. Mm-hmm. Poco. Yeah. Poco. Yeah, there's mini tiny little poco so hey. Yeah, hey. It could be and uh, yeah, a lot of opportunities, <laughs> traveling yeah, opportunities. Yeah, Funny yeah, enough, yeah. I've never been further than South Africa. Mm-hmm. Is it? No. I must take you to Botswana. Please. Yes, I'm gonna take you. Can you, you do there. that? Okay. I will. I yeah. Will. It's a promise. Let's do that. Yes, yes. Are we going for real? There yes. are witnesses. Yes, we yeah. have witnesses you on wait? camera. Oh, yeah, yes, you're in trouble yes. for this if you don't, no, no, don't yeah, worry. fulfill don't worry. that. Growing up. Uh, yeah. growing up here? I grew up here. I grew up uh, with my grandmother. Um, she's the one that raised me. She's the one that raised um, all of my cousins. You know, mm-hmm. um, all of my <clears throat> all of ch- her children's children. Basically, mm-hmm. she's the one that raised. I don't know why her children decided to just dump us mm-hmm. with her. <laughs> <laughs> they were like, "We're doing this," <laughs> you know. But then mm-hmm. all of us just. But like, I think as ev- everyone grew, um, everyone started like. Um, my cousins and them were like being taken away. Now they they had the opportunity to be raised by their parents, but now I was just stuck with my grand. Mm-hmm. Like all my life, I was just being just there with. And, and and I'm sure that's where your grounding comes from in terms of very much. You know, I th- church yeah. and religion, because obviously when you're yeah. Wana Ufumu, yeah. growing up, you know for sure that yeah. you're always gonna pray. You have mm. like a little nightmare. They tell you pray. <laughs> yeah, you say they ah, do God that. Let's go very, pray. Mm. And 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 I think. But like as 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 they grow, they they they. I don't I don't want to say they lose that strictness, but they they become more softer. They become softer in yeah, that yeah, area of yeah. of religion and yeah, all that stuff. Yeah. And then it, it's funny how then we become the ones that are very strict in our faith and are very um, uh, orderly. And mm-hmm. you know we yeah. we are the ones that like you're, you're the ones that say hey, hey it's don't Sunday, do that. hey, 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 don't, hey, hey. yeah. So yeah. so it's funny how now. The the who taking Anna Anna what's this metaphor? Kaposin eh ring eh cheni jaifa futa. Yeah yeah yeah. I was the jaifa futa thing. I can't believe we're both horrible. Actually, okay, yeah, like never that. mind that. Let's forget <laughs> that happened. Let's <laughs> <laughs> <Anyway. laughs> forget that happened. Jaifa, every jaifa who futa. Hey, oh, okay. I don't, I, don't, I don't know. I don't go down with that. Fight. Hello. <laughs> no. Shout no. out, please. Uh-huh. Yeah. So then that's where you kind of. Like had that uh, aspect of religion and just like going to church and just mm. your I, I, God and all that. <clears throat> well, it was more of a choice. It's been it's a choice. Mm-hmm. It's it's not. She didn't like force me into yeah, anything. Yeah, yeah. Of mm-hmm. course, I had a choice either to go or to stay. But mm-hmm. she had an influence, of course, mm-hmm. because I loved her, mm-hmm. because I respected her, because because I I acknowledged her doctrine. Mm-hmm. So I guess yeah, she had like a huge impact on 
my faith and you know and my yeah and my strictness to it i guess mm -hmm. i think well, well to be honest it's not even her i think i found all of that on my own mm -hmm. as i understood what it was as i was growing yeah up. but obviously as, as we were a, younger eh, as she, i was younger she would, she would, teach she would you eh, eh, yeah you know, as i was younger it was a different mm, situation I but see. like as i was younger also i was a I was a problem yes it yeah. Elaborate on that. Problem. <laughs> How so? How was your problem? I was a problem in that I was. Whew, um, so my mom and them were very, <clears throat> they're very easygoing. Mm -hmm. So they don't have that authority, authoritative hand or voice or, mm -hmm. you know, so they just, they're easygoing. If anything you want, do whatever you want. <laughs> they're mm -hmm. so hippie like. See, yeah. See, they're, so they're always like, yeah, do whatever you want. Do whatever floats your boat, buddy. They're so like that. Mm -hmm. Like, okay, of course they don't say those words, but you know, you can tell. You can oh, tell. She's, oh, yeah. Okay, sure, yeah. Sure. So, so I've been very free to do what I like. Mm -hmm. And, and, and sometimes it will go to a point of disrespect to my grandmother mm -hmm. because I feel like my mom would let me get away with it. So I can, so I'd be like, ah, oh, no, but mama, we visit, and, you know, mm -hmm. to my grandma. And that would be like, mm, okay. But so I, yeah, so I guess in that sense, I was very problematic in that. At, at what age was this? this a teenager. Yeah. you come to Cuban links as, as a teenager. Yeah, I really was. You yell, yell. I <laughs> really was. This. And I think, I think because most, unlike most people, I was a late bloomer. Mm -hmm. I was a late bloomer. And I did everything that I wanted when I wanted, you know, in that era where I was exposed to being my own person. Mm -hmm. This is the influence come that came from my mom and mm -hmm. them, you know. So I was a problem. I'm not gonna lie. Mm -hmm. Ayo, I ayo, I hey. You but but you don't look like the type. I am. Um because <laughs> you you look very grounded I and am. very solid in what you want. I do I more. am is it is it something you're developing now or has it always been there? I think it's a channel. I think being able to channel it in the right place mm -hmm. because when you channel that sort of stubbornness into in, the, in into the wrong, wrong into everything then wrong to, then yeah, it's yeah, chaotic yeah. you know so i think yeah. you, I've, I've had my fair share of chaos really yeah would you say you've done a lot mm, yeah I, I mean i wouldn't fair because enough. yeah it's it's no not... actually it's a lot because i if i had to change it mm -hmm. i would uh, if i if i had an opportunity to be like mm -hmm. oh to to re, to go back, to and, go change back and change a lot yeah. of things. I really would change a lot of things. For instance, I have a child. Glory to God, it's a gift from God. But mm -hmm. the way it happened was not like it was one of the problematic things oh, about it. Like, oh. It's like why? Why? Mm -hmm. Obviously, a child is, is a gift from God. Yeah. But would you would you in a way put it as it, it was a result of you being problematic? Yeah. yeah. Oh, Definitely. I, see. I I don't think if I was in the right state of mind and the right doctrine, the right principles, and that I would I don't think that would have happened. Mm -hmm. Was it was it an uh, the issue of I I don't have much to answer to. Like there's no like I don't have It was an issue of to. stupidity. Okay, uh, Kizzy. It was dumb. Like why are we out here? <laughs> like, <laughs> like I think we should have that topic once like No, let's have it now. You yeah, know, and it's like why are we out here just sleeping with people like why? Why yeah. is it why would why like for what and now next thing you have a child and now next thing you want to make it look oh, well you want to sub you know um justify or like reason with the fact that you did this horrible thing that you shouldn't have done in the first place and now you want to you want people to to validate it or to like approve it because now if they're not approving it or if they're not validating it then they're, they're not loving you mm -hmm. or they're not also also the fact that you're saying you're a late bloomer so i think also yeah. that also count, counted that yeah. my friends have done things Yay. except me so the best thing i can <laughs> hello <do>. crazy <laughs> let's go <laughs> but was i, think I hear that was you that, right? i hear you but like i think i don't think that's an excuse to mm. be a late bloomer. obviously obviously hey i don't think yeah. it's an excuse to like let loose yeah. of you of your principles and your guard like your parameters but also those stages have to come you know it's somebody not a stage. no it is i'll it's tell you why coffee. somebody was asking me about the podcast and what's the coffee. Yeah, no, no, i like for sure, coffee for sure. yeah I, I'm sorry. I love coffee <laughs> okay. so somebody was asking me about my like the podcast and what the podcast is about yeah so i told them you know it's, it's a bit of everything at times we'll be fun we'll be crazy yeah. at times we're going to be serious and talk about mm. you know things and principles like we're talking now yeah. because i also along the way want to talk to you about you know 
what you think your purpose in life is because oh my God. We, we we have to kind of find that within ourselves because yeah. it kind of anchors us into yeah. who we are and what we need to do yeah can i ask you a question are you having fun in this in this interview are you is this yes. too uptight for you no I'm, okay no i'm loving it don't worry don't worry because <laughs> I, <okay. laughs> I feel like oh to me a girl no no be no, more no. youthful honey what's going on no no but that's the thing also it's a balance life is about balance you have to balance See, that's properly. another thing. I don't believe in balance. I think life should be about balance. Really? There should be okay. time for everything. Time for play, yeah. time for work, okay. time for this. Okay. So, yeah, we have to balance. I get that. But I don't can, think that's a balance, always, though. It is. You can is it? Be, it's like life. I think it's season. It's not no, balance. it's balance. In life, okay. you cannot always be happy. Yeah, true. There's going to be times when you're sad, uh -huh. so that you know what happiness There's is. There's a time for everything. So I get that. So that's what I'm saying. It has to be about balance. You balance it out. You say, I have time to be happy. And the time to be said. Okay, so you see, my problem with the word balance mm -hmm. is evenness at a certain time. No, 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 not even. Okay. Yes. It shouldn't be too. It's about kind of 50 kg. Hey. You know, okay. at times it has to be 50. I got 50 and I think I'm, I'm, you, I'm one you know? person that believes in 100%. <laughs> No, but it cannot always be hundred. Because here, here's what I'm saying. Mm. If like you're saying, there's a season for everything. There's a time yeah. for everything. There's yeah. time to be sad yeah. and happy. There's time for wealth and poverty. There's time mm. for this and that. Mm. There's time to sit and dance. There's you know, there's time play, for everything. There's time to work. To, to yeah. work, you know. Yeah. Yeah. But in in any season that you're in at that particular season, I think you should give it one hundred percent. Yes, for sure. You know, that's not, why not a eighty twenty, not yeah, a sixty forty. Don't regret anything. But also understand that hundred yes, what Easy. I do, I'm giving it my best shot. Either it's playing. If you're gonna play, play, that play evening, please. Keep and Mazia with me. Please, you. <laughs> make sure, make sure. You know what I mean. That's we still have a lot more to talk about Honestly. with you. Uh, we obviously, like I'm saying, want to talk what, about high purpose in life. Want to mm. talk about you know motherhood. Want to talk about you know hand things that she loves. And also along the way, as you know, standard procedure on the podcast, we always want to put some people on. Yeah. So find who she wants to put on. Either it's a musician, a yeah. graphic designer, Ooh, yes. a camera guy, a drums person, because she also does. She performs music. Yeah. So we'll talk about all of those. So make sure you keep it locked right here. Quickly, let me thank our sponsors. We'll be right back. We live like every moment. It's in the highlight reel for the best night. You know my stuff. Best nights for today and tomorrow. Not for persons under the age of 18. Welcome back. We're still here on the Crazy and Friends. And I'll tell you the most funniest things. I think Tamiya just knows how to say the most funny things. Two seconds before we start going live, like it's weird. She's like, I'm gonna put 16 sugars, don't mind the, the intake. The intake, no, A. Hey. Yeah, no, I totally that's get it. That's one other thing that, you know, in my childhood, that just mm -hmm. used to just do, just mm -hmm. to put sugar. I don't know if anybody did this when they were younger. Maybe mm. you probably, you look like you were the type to do that. What, what, what I used what to, every that? time after school, mm -hmm. just before I went out for playing, I used to like put sugar in like a plastic. Mm -hmm. There used to be one thing I look forward to every time. Was that weird? Does anybody ever do? Okay. Yeah, just me? Weird. Okay. I think that's Can you just take that part weird. out? Please. No, we're okay. not going to take it out. <laughs> that's weird. No. Really? Guys. I used to do that all the time. The things that we did time. as kids. I hope my, my grandma's not going to watch this. No, your grandma's definitely watching this. Actually, no, now she you might. see where all your SSP, LSP wins. She's such, she's she, a, she's she a took big all of it. fan. She might just watch it. So now, so that's good. That's good. Now, when it comes to the music, yeah. um, you one day wake up. Vodacom, Vodacom, again, the super... You want yeah, superstars? Yeah? I did. I did. What was it called? Le, step up. I, yeah, I don't. Step up. Yeah. Step okay. Up. Well, I just know Vodacom was the sponsor, so I was like, yeah. Vodacom superstars. Vodacom was a sponsor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want that. <clears throat> how do you become part of the competition? Was it something that you planned, or nope. how did it happen? You know the story, right? Tell me. Um, okay. I don't know if I <laughs> they don't. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to remind I get you. I all of the stories. I forget so, some. So, like, what happened was um, I had this sister of mine. Um, Mazon. And she, I remember she was like, at the time I was very pregnant, but nobody knew. It was a complete secret from everybody. Cause now I'm, I'm here pregnant and it's like, why are you pregnant? And I can't tell nobody. It's, I have a question on that. Yeah, yeah. I know you're about to tell me a story it's of how okay, you joined. It's okay. It's a whole but, thing. But yeah, we're going to talk yeah. about that. But now, let, let before you get there, cause I want to know the, like how things happen. Yeah. You fall pregnant. Yeah. When? Hey, yo, I was in college. Do you want to tell us about your baby daddy? No, he ain't worth this interview. Ain't what? nobody worth it. 
Okay, I'm sorry. But 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 is he somebody popular? Yeah, I mean he's important. That I important mean important in the country. Yeah, he's an advocate. So <laughs> what's the name? No, nah, I can't. Cause like does they he might have, like, sue me. They does, might does sue have, does me. Does he have like his own firm? Uh, I don't know. I don't care like, about him that much. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm being insensitive. No, but it's fine. Cause nah, cause, you don't care. No, that's fine. I do. Let me care. Let mm. me care because this person is good. She's <laughs> like a bast, guys. No, nah, no, nah, I'm saying I'm sanctified. I, uh, this no, is you honestly, trying to be a good person. Yeah, no, but you know, let's love each other, guys. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> She doesn't he's an care. amazing, he he, he's an amazing guy, Listen, it's and I have so thing. much respect for him. I do. I have a lot of respect for him. Yeah, obviously. Mm. <laughs> you, you went in there. Anyway, you let, me to be. let me tell you. Okay. <laughs> anyway, I was in college. So, did you guys plan it? No, of course okay, not. Okay, so what happened? We were. Was it like one night of? It wasn't. Years? It really wasn't. And to, you guys dating? Yeah. Okay. And I, I remember telling him this. Cause I'm, a, I've been a Christian for a long time. I remember telling him, I can we wait for a bit till in in in, in. Mm. and then obviously you know guys with manipulative minds, they're like, okay, yeah. He's like, yeah, okay, yeah, I totally get that. Cause I remember mentioning it, but he's so he was so intimidating to me that I, I ended up yielding to having sex with him, mm-hmm. and it was obviously only because he's a lawyer. <laughs> no, he, you know what I mean. Ah, oh, don't man, put disgusting. You. But anyway, I, I ended up, like, it was my fault because, like, I really loved him. I really, like, oh, my gosh. He was cute. He was all of that. It was like, oh, my gosh. I'm dating somebody. And he cute. He working and all of that. And it was just like, oh, my gosh. Look at you with your cute. So this was, like, this was, like, one of those days where you guys are chilling. I was just, yeah, yes. Like, oh, no, wait. This, this particular time, mm-hmm. he bought me food. On his way from work, and Megidula, obviously, like as a, in college, you have like a little flat mm-hmm, thing, mm-hmm. not even a flat, just like one of those accommodations, yeah, student yeah. accommodations. Mm-hmm. And he came by and he bought me food. It was cute, and we just it just happened. And I knew, you know, I knew after mm-hmm. it happened. I'm like, oop, I'm in trouble. Uh oh. This is it. This <laughs> so on your first experience. Oh no, that wasn't my first experience. Oh, okay. That was like my second experience after the first experience. Does oh, that make oh, but, sense? But like, was it the first time with him? Yeah. Hectic. Yeah. So first time yeah. in the and that was it. Yeah, someone's calling Kuzi. We wanna just shut this down. But who's calling me, guys? I'm shooting. Who's this? I don't know. It's not the same number. Can I say V one? <laughs> but hey, yeah, let me. What, what do you want to know about? Like, do you want to know about the daddy, or do you know? No, like, do you want to know about the competition? Like, make up your no, mind. No, no, no. We, we, we want to talk about everything. You guys, uh, unplanned. Edits, unplanned, very then, much. I feel like y'all should just stop having sex on in outside of marriage. Just stop, because you're gonna have a baby, and you're not gonna have money for diapers. I remember one other thing. <laughs> and one then other thing. guy checked out. No, the no, 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 just no, no. Out like. like no, this is a real thing stop that actually much? happened. No, seriously, like, stop having sex. Stop it. Stop it. Just stop. <laughs> Honestly, this is just no. Hey, if you all of the whole the whole Maseru just whole signed thing, off. I'm They're telling like, you, log out. This is just lo- <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> no, stop what? If they log out, they're not really? listening anymore. Yeah. <laughs> like what Tamir? No, what please, Tamir please. is saying is nonsense. I think people should start saying this more often. So you 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 advise people to stop having sex. Yeah, things. one other one thing that happened. Oh, God, please, we'll forget. Oh, oh God. Yeah. One thing that happened. Is that I remember having to sell my guitar. It was new. No way my mom's gonna see this. And she will be so pissed. Oh my god. No, she'll understand. She bought me, my mom and dad bought me a guitar for mm-hmm. my birthday, I mm-hmm. remember. Mm-hmm. But I didn't have that I didn't have I, I didn't like relying on my parents for Nala. Mm-hmm. That's my son's name. Mm-hmm. Shout out to Nala. Boy. Mm-hmm. Anyway, any so I didn't want to rely on my parents for like diapers and milk and stuff like that. So I, I remember having to, I remember my, my grandma called me like, hey, wanna hand and take a music. I remember taking my guitar. I, look, I looked into my room. I was like, what can I purchase? I mean, what can I sell and mm. purchase diapers? I looked at my guitar. It was very new. It was so new. And I called it um, Jasmine because mm-hmm. it was just. Why don't you call Uncle Queasy? I mean, a guitar, Uncle Queasy. No, call me. Instead of selling your guitar, let's go buy it back. Hey, I don't know. Yeah. It's not there anymore. You know, I tried going back to Cash Crusaders. It wasn't there anymore. You sold it there. Ah, that's so what they I probably think. gave you 200. 
They did. But <laughs> <laughs> they did give me 200. But I bought, I, I, I managed to buy diapers and milk. Mm -hmm. And I remember going straight home, delivering the thing. But I felt so good and fulfilled. I was like, at least this I'm is what I did for myself. That, I'm yeah, responsible. You, you, sold, you sold part of you. I did. Yeah. And it felt, it doesn't matter. Cause you I, felt like I a slay queen. I'm so not. Look at me. You felt like one at that time. I get like you sold a part of you. So. For some diapers. But, but that's a baby. Yeah, but no, the thing is... If, if it was the other way around, that would be like selling my soul. But it was like my child. That was... It was true, not the same. Come true, on, Queen. True, true. It's you not fall, the same. You fall pregnant and mm. plan. Mm. Um, Don't try it at home, kids. Please stay okay, pure. Okay, just try it at Cuban links. So, it's fine. <laughs> it's not funny, dude. Stop. No, it is. <laughs> Okay. You fall pregnant, you go into uh, the competition. Hey, okay. How do you <clears throat> find out about the competition? Were you at home chilling? Then, and then... I was telling you, mm -hmm. now we get, I always do this, I, we, we always get distracted. Okay, yeah. so on the day of the competition, mm -hmm. sh Mother We had so sent me the poster prior, mm -hmm. like a long time ago. Mm -hmm. But I was like, ah, I'm not interested in this. You know, I was so, I was very prideful in my talents. I was very prideful in it. I was just like, I'm, I don't do wow. this, I, I don't do this. Yeah. Okay. I was because. I'll explain later. So like, and then on the day she reminded me, she's like, remember today, don't be late, nine o'clock, be there. I, I, I went there at 3 p.m. I remember, and there was this huge queue. And the reason why I went there was because I had thought to my, there was a light bulb thing that came to my head. I was like, wait, if I join this competition and if I, I stay longer in the competition, there's a reward of staying at a guest house. Mm -hmm. And now I may no longer have to be at in my household so that my grandma, my grandma wouldn't find out that I'm pregnant. So I, I have longer time to deal with the situation. <laughs> so I was like, you know what? Let me go into the competition, not because <laughs> of the competition, but because to hide, for it to be like a hideaway for me to deal with my situation, my complex situation. Mm -hmm. And I went to, um, at the time I was singing in church, and I went to Memadiza. Memadiza, oh, I don't know if I was supposed to. No, it's yeah, fine, shout it's out fine, to yeah. Memadiza. She's like our HOD at church. Mm -hmm. I went to her and told her, she doesn't know I'm pregnant, by the way. I went to her and tell, told her, okay, I'm about to join this competition. When? Now. Downstairs, like right now. Mm -hmm. It's happening. So yeah. I get all when I'm going, go, that's where I'm going. Mm -hmm. And then she's like, okay, yeah, yeah, join the competition. And it's like, okay, as long as I got your approval. So she doesn't know why I'm in the competition. Mm -hmm. Okay. In fact, in fact, I remember that's when I told her. I think I told her that day. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I think I told her I was pregnant. She cried. I remember her crying. It was so sad. I cried too. It was just an emotional breakdown for mm -hmm. everybody. Mm -hmm. And I okay, joined the competition. I sang this one song, and then my voice was like shaking. I was so nervous. And the people, the judges was like, mm -mm, girl, get your life. Sing pro. What is this? What is What's this? going yeah, on? Yeah. Like, you know, and then I obviously got approved to the next round and the next and the next top 10. Um, and now in the top 10, when I was like in top five, maybe that's when I told my parents. Imagine as in this time, I'm like five months to six months pregnant. Imagine. Anyways, so I told my grandma, I wrote her a letter because we just have our mother in person. I wrote a letter and I got there. Oh, Nikki Kupilo, a high because not necessarily like guest house. And so I had, I had written her a letter and then I put her, I put it um, through the door because she was at church and she had locked the door of her bedroom. And I put it under the, the, the door. The door. Like, yeah, yeah. And then she read it and then she called me at 9 uh, p.m. in the night. She's like, because now we had already gone to the guest house. And she's like, do you want me to, to talk? Do you want to talk about this now? Or do you want me to call you in the morning? I'm like, please call me in the morning. She's like, okay, no problem. And then she called me in the morning. We talked about it. She's like, no, I, um, it's okay. I don't want to say things I do. I don't talk about it. I thought she was, girl, mm, my grandmama, mm, mm, she don't like, play like that. I thought she was going to disown me. I mm. thought she would stay there. Mm. <laughs> 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 but, <laughs> but, <laughs> but she was like very very uh, welcoming and she said I forgive you and I was like oh my god I cried I burst into tears I remember it was just like oh, what have I done it was and then when do you tell your mom really? uh, I think because I didn't grow up with my mom it was mm -hmm. it wasn't as tense as my grandma mm -hmm. you know it was also my mom I was like hey oh you 
I mean, you happen to you too. You post them the same. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry if you watch it. <laughs> it's like it happened to you too. You post to understand. Come yeah. on, girl, don't be acting brand new okay. like the same happened to you 21 years ago. Come on, be and, for and real. Then, and then she was fine with it. Oh, she wasn't fine with it. She wasn't fine with it. Um, she asked me what I wanted to do with it. She's like, "Are you ready to have a child?" What a what a what a. I, like, I baby think, girl, even if I didn't want you, I'm five months in. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> I'm like, I have to have it. Mm -hmm. I have, girl, be mm -hmm. for real. It's like, mm -hmm. you ain't seen my belly. You ain't seen it? You ain't see how big it is? Come on, be for real. Anyways, so like, yeah, that happened. And then in the competition further. And then I remember praying to God. It's like, God, you know what? Now that my parents know, here's what's going to happen. Mm -hmm. I don't want this car if it's not meant to be mine. I remember praying. Because we had like, we had like these amazing worship sessions in the, in the whole competition. Mm -hmm. I remember... Uh, we could come we could come together in the in the in the living room in the mm -hmm. living room space and we would pray as the top 10 of mm -hmm. of the comp step up competition mm -hmm. competitors mm -hmm. and i remember that day i prayed to god i was like god if this car is not mine i don't want it please keep it my parents now know that i'm pregnant it's it's no it's so what i came here for we're it's, good, it's good yeah. yeah i don't have to hide anymore or mm -hmm. if i can go back home so if this car is not mine, I don't want. In this little corner, you focus on on the competition. On the competition. And then I think that's how you won, hey? Because yeah, I prayed a lot. You were you were like, I'm not, I'm not about this. No, I really wasn't. Yeah, I, comes, to be honest, I'm you were sorry. Not, hey? I'm sorry. Uh, shout out Sway, to everybody. No. I apologize. He, he wanted saying, this. Sometimes he's saying he wanted sorry. It so bad, he wanted so bad. So bad. But who is the less faith you swear? Because he went there with a license. He, he, you, okay. yep. He went there with a license. I said, so, nah, I'm going to do this. This is my car. I'm like, yo, brother, your faith. Mm. My brother. I love it. I my love brother. it. And then it I love it. it. Don't laugh. Aga, we na aga. Why is he laughing? <laughs> you put me in an awkward position. No. Don't laugh. <laughs> Don't laugh. Brother. You can't mean. He yeah, laughed at me, you What's going on? He's your next. No, but yeah, he's my boy. He knows. I'll, I'll laugh about it with him okay. also. Okay, yeah. But... He got a car too, and he's still driving it, and I'm not driving no more. So Wait, Lord you got a God, car too? How? His church bought him a car. The the BMW. His pastor, yeah, um, which is amazing. Isn't that beautiful? They bought him a car. They why? bought him a car. That's why they not? Because he deserve to win. Yeah, that's okay. okay. That's that's fine too, right? I don't know. <laughs> you guys got the same church. We don't. But why you be like this? Why do? <laughs> Why did you like this? I don't know. It's, like, um, it's a good thing. I it it is. It's a great thing. Yeah, I mean, it's a good thing they they're showing car. appreciation to him. And, and he's still driving it. See, I'm not driving my car and he is. What, what did you do to your car? I, you gave it a boy. Right. <laughs> <laughs> gave it to a boy? I'm leaving. This is over. <laughs> Cut. Let's just go home. <laughs> what happened to my car is a yo. If this friend of mine, Tinko Paul, was sending me Kuka. I am going to tell you the truth as it is. I'm not gonna lie. Please. This friend of mine was like, "Hey, kupanguto hanna, shaka kupanguto hanna." With my car. Yeah. Hectic. Your girl. Your girl. Being the. Ding ding da 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 da. Ding ding ding. Your girl <laughs> was like, "Oh no no, cool it's cool, girl. Oh, yeah, got you. Come come in the driver's seat. Come. So nigel kamu ting hamatala. You know hamatala. They're like worse." <laughs> <laughs> Don't laugh, girl. Why are you laughing? Una una di di Cool roads and all, you know. It's a cool neighborhood. It's a suburb. <laughs> Praise God. Okay, so, so she's like, I want to lie down. I'm like, girl, say no more. Hold my God. Say no more. <laughs> and oh, then, hold my and, then, <laughs> and then she came in the driver's seat and I went to the passenger seat. And then I told her what to do. Mm -hmm. And then she did good for a little bit. <laughs> she was doing good for a little bit. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, I asked her, had you done this before? She's like, yeah, a little bit. I'm like, okay, girl, come, come on in. And then, I don't, I guess I'll put on guy, but no one I'm on the radio, and then, I said, I'm going to go to the So, come on, I'm going to go to the radio. So, come on, I'm going to go to the radio. Okay, so, mm -hmm. she, she comes in the, the, the driver's seat. And then, I tell her what to do. Do this, do that, clutch. Slowly, one, two gear. Mm -hmm. Girl put on the second gear, and <laughs> girl put on 
stepped on the, the accelerator thinking it's the brakes and it's not the brakes but then she, she wants to stop mm -hmm. but she really going and I guess no one in Nike daily who who the handbrake yeah. right and then it went straight into someone's wall that's what happened to the car shout out to step up the suit too shout out to your friend though <laughs> yeah yeah, I still love her though. I still, it's just a car. A car is a car. Our friendship should be more important. Awkward silence. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. Because I just want to understand what you're thinking. What hey, is. yo, I was trying to be a good friend to somebody, you know. So you guys are still friends today? I would like to believe so because I love her. Did you? Did she, I care about her a lot. Like after that, did she like say, I'm just going to try and pay? I mean, she, yeah, she did try and pay. Um. She's been trying to pay. I appreciate. <laughs> been? I appreciate. No, so don't, say don't say it like that. I don't. Quizzy. Quizzy. Don't say like that. I mean it. Did I mean you sell she. The car though? No, I'm it's still going to drive it. Shout out. So what do you. Okay, listen. I man. see y'all laughing at me and me like, oh my God. <laughs> no, but your also. Car. But, now, but also. <laughs> <now, laughs> that God's whistle has his. Yeah, so, you see what I mean? Yeah. God is good. Yeah, yeah God is like, it sounds. Yeah, like, I swear, not like, yeah. And it, which is amazing. So, the guy's still there. Yeah. What do you need to fix on it? People are watching. I think. In case they might help. You know, Pimp, please the, help you know, you know, the Bible says you must expose <laughs> things. Mm. I don't know. <laughs> You gave it to another man. My I was scrapyard. I was in the computer box. What's it this? What's it like? Guys, wireless at the pahali. Kina na usa kagi the computer box. Um, pula computer box ni nita. So now he has to pay it. Now it's a whole thing. So you can't the scrap yard now. Glory to God. <laughs> God is good all the time, and all the time God is good. Okay. But, but also, but I'm such a child little, little though. Little okay. little little I know. Yeah, thing. like God is good. Please. Yeah, I'm Call sorry. Call my boys from my face, please. I'm sorry. I want that. I want that I know if y'all are judging me so much, I no, judge no. myself a little. Crazy. Well, you? I am. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I just want to know your I, thinking pattern. Also, my thinking pattern, like, I'm such a child at heart. Yeah, it shows. Or, or like, my brain pattern. Um, It shows. I, yeah. Yeah, here you are. But I don't, no I like arm. it, though. I, I really, I, I enjoy it. It's so spontaneous. It's like, you never know what's coming. <laughs> it's like, oh, oh, yeah, no car. All right, oh. let's go. No car. Well, was that what you thought? When you felt it coming, you were like, oh. No, I was very, I think at, when it happened. No, I'm talking about the baby, though. Oh, the baby. Yeah. Let me just finish Did the car when, 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 when you felt coming, you thought. No, the baby, Nikisabili. The baby, <laughs> the baby, Nikisabila, only because. Mm -hmm. Also, it took, it, 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 it took me into a very deep depression. Oh, where yeah, I felt yeah. like my future was being taken away from me. Mm -hmm. I couldn't further my studies. I couldn't, even though my teachers, because they really liked me. Ugh, I love y'all. Nekwena. That day, M MJ, I really love all of them. They were, yeah. they were loving, they yeah. loved me, yeah. and I really appreciate them. Um, um, I, they even asked me to go back and finish, even though, even after the competition when I was done, they would call me, I was like, no, no, no. <laughs> when you said, <served? laughs> uh, yeah, they were was like, it that no, big no, no. The competition? I remember seeing a lot well, of it. Yeah, it was very small. I don't know why. I think it was very small. You couldn't even tell, even when. I was about to give, you could, it was very small. Unless it's because I've always been baggy clothes and people can't really tell what's going on and mm. whatnot. Um, uh -huh. So I was saying, w when I got pregnant, I think it, it was very depressing. Mm -hmm. I, I felt like my future was just taken away from me. Yeah. I feel like someone just came and took all of my plans, all of now my... obviously there's a baby that you have to take care yeah, of. Yeah, and then abandon your life. Yeah, but are you are you those people that believe that your, your, your child comes before you? Yeah, no, nah. Nah, I'm one of the people that think that a child is God's responsibility. Okay. In in a sense that he it's his child, so I mustn't worry about anything that involves them, you know. But okay. instead, be submissive to God's wisdom and understanding in raising them. As far as everything, you know, you know, I, I, we live in a society where people think that a child is very expensive, and a child isn't expensive. It's just, yeah, hear me out. It's just like, it's just like, um, it's just a lot of people live their, live their lives through their children. Like they want to be seen in these carts that you drive in the mall. They want to be seen in these fancy things and cool clothes and content. Their children is their content. 
And my child was not that. My child was not that for me. My child was like my child. My so child you're saying was, the baby's not expensive? Nah. Nah. Nope. I think a baby is not expensive, but instead a baby is an opportunity. A baby is a, is, a, is a gift in the sense that God finally shows you what it means to be selfless. Yeah, yeah, sure. In a sense. But a baby is expensive, my love. You nah. did mention you're still young, so we understand. No, nah, it's not. I'm, I'm being paying bills. for real. Have you started paying bills. Yeah. School I mean, fees. I was independent for a while in college. <laughs> I mean, yeah. And, and what's that thing? Mm -hmm. uh, what I'm. Quizzy, I need you to understand what I'm saying. Is mm -hmm. that a lot of people. By having a child, but it's a, this idle thing that they think you have to have things. You don't have to have things. You don't have to have like a baby. You have to have money. Well, yeah, but. Mm, no, but. There, there are a lot of accessories on kids that are unnecessary. Like? Like the, everything but else. But that's his preference. But now having a baby is expensive. I mean, it makes it easier. Here you are, you sold your guitar. Let's let's also Which was not, good. let's also not be you know I, I'm not lying to the people and say I'm not lying. To children, them. dear children watching, don't have a baby, don't get pregnant. She mentioned yes, for but real. That was guys, a thing. But also, babies are expensive. No, no, no. My point is here. I thought because babies are expensive. Yeah, wait. <laughs> babies are expensive. Can I just and start, just start paying fees? Cause... Babies are expensive. Cousy. <laughs> Hi. Okay. Um. Nah. Yeah. Yeah. Great. But <laughs> that's what I want. To agree with. But what I'm, my, my point? Expensive. Can I just make my point? God, sure. please help me make this very important point. Mm. We shouldn't make our babies. We shouldn't live through our babies. That's true. In the sense that we want them to be content. Or, or yeah, yeah. Like don't, don't. Also, don't live your your goals and aspirations through your children. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But but a child is expensive. Okay, perhaps great, it is. Yeah. Great. That's all. Yeah. That okay. Yeah. A for. child. You need to when you have a child you have in a for. family and marriage, you have to be financially stable. Yeah. That's right? that's that's what we were going for. Okay. Great. Um, a a, a few years later, no car, mm -hmm. no guitar, but you still want to do music, right? I don't know. Really? Mm -hmm. yeah. You want to stop doing music? I music is is more than entertainment. In fact, if I had it in any other way, I would not do it as an entertainment. I'm not an entertainer. Mm -hmm. You get it? Yeah. I think when I remember years ago when I was still in church, I remember saying making a promise to God I was like my voice will only be yours mm -hmm. will only be to you are you okay mm -hmm. you seem mm -hmm. kind of distressed yeah <laughs> I'm, I'm worried <laughs> like the child what's going on i'm a bit worried that's yeah. all yeah yeah and i remember making a promise to god is that everything else i could do for anybody and everybody but mm -hmm. this voice i would like it to i would like to preserve it to you and as time went on after especially after the, the competition i think that promise faded mm -hmm. You understand what yeah, I mean? See. It faded and I forgot who I, I had promised God that I would put aside my talent for him. But let me tell you what I think. Yeah, I thought that too. I know what you're going to say. No, 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 no. What I think mm -hmm. is that if, if, if God gives you a talent, mm -hmm. he is going to help guide you into what you should do with it. Mm -hmm. And then also, I was talking about this already a few days ago. Mm -hmm. Taraji Pian said, mentioned something that was very nice and profound. said, don't try to be the, the greatest. Yeah. what you do yeah just try to definitely be live out your purpose through what your talent is if yeah. you're a singer what message are you passing through what are you shifting and changing people's lives yeah you know, that's where i think you should be because that, yeah. that then comes back to that's that true. what i was asking about that's your purpose true. in life and yeah. in music what's your purpose are you are you trying to you know get people to shake booty on the on the stage See? or, or hey. do you want to heal people like how i think you know louisa right yeah Loiso sings from Loiso, the heart. Loiso, with the, a double L. Yeah. 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 That, that guy sings from the heart. You know? Like, he sings from the heart, but, and then what, guys? And then you change people's lives. See? Because you listen to his music and then your perspective about things change. You're like, oh, okay. Here's a healer. coffee is so good. That's no, so good. see, that's the thing. I think he does. Society, society does. has trained us to think that people heal people. People don't heal people. People don't heal people. No, fam. Only God heals people. 
What about prophets and pastors? They don't heal people. No, God heals people, not 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 people. It's not people that heal people. God heals people. And I think we need to run away from the the thought or the a. We need to run away from the thought that people heal people. Oh, I'm a healer. You're not. A, sit down. Sit down. Sure. Sit. Sit down. You're you know not what? A, no. Nah, you, nah, I, I, you know what? Come on. I, I need to refill my coffee, guys. We're going to take a break and sell a little bit. Because this, it needs more. I don't People heal hey, people. Nah, fam. Nope. Okay. She'll explain it better when we come back. Make sure you don't go anywhere. Otherwise, like, subscribe, comment, Please share. Please like, subscribe, and that. comment, share. Like, watch this whole video, y'all. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. You we say no back. joke. <laughs> Are you having fun? So from now on, I think the whole time when I come back from a break, I'm going to come back laughing because Tamia is always saying the most weird and funny things ever. Yeah. Anyway, we're just about to wrap up with her. And I mentioned oh, we're going to talk about I a lot, of, a lot of things. We haven't talked about relationships and maybe uh, the future in terms of music. We're not sure if she still wants to do music or not. Let's find out that quickly. quickly. If you want to do music. I want to do what God wants me to do. I don't know what it is yet. So how do you know what God wants you to do? Cool, how do you know what God wants you to do? That's what that's my purpose. I find my purpose. You found it? Yeah. I haven't. I think I have. I have figured that. I think I these have. microphones and these cameras that we, we speak into, mm. let's speak the truth and let's like I was saying, heal people through yeah. it. Healing people doesn't mean I'm gonna take you to the doctor and yeah. heal you. No, but, that's not what I think. But my thing is if I speak the truth mm -hmm. and if something can relate to, mm -hmm. then then that's me <clears> helping you become a, big, a better person. Yeah. That's I think that's my purpose in life. Like mm. somebody's asking me, oh no, you're off the morning show, so why are you not? Blah, can I blah, take blah. the morning show? Okay, I wanted to do that. Oh okay, I guess. I really did. Talk to whoever's responsible. Yeah, we we'll talk about that. That's another thing. Anyway, yeah. we have we have a limited time. Yeah. So I I think I know what my purpose is, and I, I think I know that I I'm. A vessel of worship. I mm -hmm. worship God, mm -hmm. and if I don't worship God, if I'm not there worshiping God, yeah. I will worship something. Yeah, and, and I and found that, that out. Be, and that anything. could be fame. That could be. You know what I mean? You know, uh, feeling like your pride, could stardom, be, yeah, yeah, anything, yeah, 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 yeah. literally anything. Mm -hmm. I could, I could worship my aesthetic and make it like an yeah. idol, if, if, anything. If, if, if you're God, because that's way, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. who I am. I work. So if I'm not in a position where God is my the apple of my eye. I I fall into deadly things. Mm. I fall. Well, I I find myself in in like very dangerous habits. Speaking of dangerous or, things, have you, have you done drugs before? Oh yeah, honey. <laughs> what have you done? <laughs> oh yeah. I'm not judging you though. Oh, I'm not judging me, babe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not judging well, me. What do you mean drugs? Have you like um, taken like your coke and your? You really want these people? No. Okay. You know what? Yeah, I'm yeah, free from that. So, honestly, your your yeah. offer does not like you're in it. Who? <laughs> Wow, Listen, I've you know. done drugs, okay? Um, I smoked a lot of weed, a lot of it, a lot, a lot. That I know. Okay? Um, but I don't do that anymore, praise God. I've done, uh, I took crystal meth um, and it burned my face, but it's not, scars gone. Did you, did you, did you see it? Did you get I didn't it? even know it was like this horrible drug. Did this you get thing. it in what? Nah. Okay. Nah, I'm not even going to tell you, because I can't expose no, these no, people. No, no, don't expose your dealer. Hey, yeah, They're yeah. not my dealer, okay? Uh -huh. But I did do Ex -dealer. it. Ex-dealer. I did do it. And and it's like, praise God, I'm not even there anymore. Okay, for real. This mm -hmm. is an actual thing that happened. And I'm not proud of it. Mm -hmm. But I am free from it, so I'm not ashamed of it. Um. So, and then I remember these people keep telling, don't stop telling people that. I'm like, it happened. Mm -hmm. And I'm free. And I want to tell, and I, I want to be. Because it, it helps people. Like the thing yeah, I'm talking about. Because you, you can't be free from any. Also, I was addicted. And even if I was unknowingly, God freed me for it. And also, it. the more you speak about your stories and experiences, you're helping other people right. who are in the same situation. Right. Because somebody's probably thinking, I want to let go of this. Yeah. But they don't have the courage and they don't, sorry, they don't even want to speak about it. And 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 I fell into it because <clears throat> I saw myself as this free spirit who can mm -hmm. do whatever they want and not be attached to it. Oh, I can do this. Oh, I, oh, 
okay, I'm going to go. So how did you, you bend know? your face? I, I didn't do how, I don't know how to do it right. And what do you do it in the mouth or it's in like, the nose? Why are you asking these questions? It's like a pipe. It's like a pipe, and you put like, uh, uh like crystals in mm. it. You know, like uh, in 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 chemistry when you're taught, oh, this produces crystals and this and this and that and this and this and that. Mm -hmm. And so the smoke it goes to your head and it gives you like serious energy and you become like. But I hate it. I hate it. I hate all that things. But I did them, and I'm free from do you, that. Do you take it from the nose or from the mouth? That's from the mouth. You pull it in the in the in the mouth. And yeah. Then it, you take the fumes in. Is that what you do? You do, and it messes up with your mind. See, and uh, these are not the things that people tell you. Is that it has serious side after effects. side effects. Mm. Serious ones. You might you might die from the headache it gives you. Like it gives you like serious headache. Like serious painful headache. It gives you like um. How much cramps? Yeah, cramps, uh, and all that stuff. What shrooms? I also did shrooms. Don't do that. Don't do that. I feel like those kind of psychedelics are like a a substitute for. Okay, I read. I'm I'm very spiritual. I'm very. Mm -hmm. I have yeah. I'm a Christian, so I'm not gonna leave this out, right? Mm -hmm. So I, as I was taking them, I remember God telling me that these are. Um, Hanagin, Hanagin to it. Um, substitutes of the Holy Spirit, and then <clears throat> it's designed to uh, hear things or receive stuff from God. But then we receive stuff from these other things that are that we see from the earth, and we think that's us. That's us, mm -hmm. and it's not. It's not. I see. It's not. Yeah. It's distractive, and it's 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 deceitful. Oh. To think that you your wisdom is, and and it's funny your how wisdom has to come from come these from substances. these substances. Yeah. You know what like I mean? It, it, it's so weed, deceitful. It makes and, you feel and you know, brighter. Brighter. Oh, and, guys, no, sorry, and, no, and you know no. that's the deceitful things about drugs is that you are you get in you you become in love with yourself with mm -hmm. your with your mind and how your mind works and you are aware of these other things and mm -hmm. oh we have we have. The time is up. Yeah, we're but yeah, don't don't do drugs because I feel like crazy. I, I need you. I it's think we need a part two of, of please. Of can we? I need. Everybody wants to come back. I, I don't know why. I need guys, Everybody wants but, to come back. I want to quickly talk about something that you said you're not sure about. Yeah. So, uh, what's your relationship like with Bondo? Okay. Okay. You wanna do that? Okay, <laughs> yeah, we're gonna cool. do that. Should we call him? No. Mm -hmm. Even my mom. You know, even my mom is like. Oh, where's Bondo? Oh, how's Bondo? I'm like, seriously? Why are you asking you me? Did you have a crush on him? No, I liked him. I didn't even have a crush. I really liked him. After we Is you like, kind of kissed. Huh? Oh, y'all kind of kissed? Yeah, to be Kinda. honest. But that's over, y'all. Over? Yeah, it's oh, not Do you want it to be thing. over or is it over no, because No, it's over because be over? I'm worth pursuing. Oh, so you don't want to throw yourself at him? I won't throw myself at anything. <laughs> or anybody. Yeah, except the lawyer. <laughs> really? <laughs> That's so not okay. Don't say stuff like that. No, the lawyer and I have like a a civil relationship. Okay, so Bondo, I know he's watching. Is he? Yeah, no, Bondo's my boy. Please, my boy, let's do this. She's here. She's saying, please pursue. I'm not. Buy saying, her flowers. She's, I'm not. not hey. saying, she's not begging. I'm not. But she, she, she's just saying, make I'm, a, I'm a beautiful young lady who knows how to dress. That's very important. <laughs> <laughs> that's, ah. that's very important. Okay. You know how important that is? Okay. If you can dress, that means your furniture going to be looking good. Yeah, that I mean, means your household going to be looking good. So that means your bathroom yes. looks good. That means you have good curtains. Do you have red curtains? No. Yeah, like no. <laughs> I tell people that have red curtains in the house no. every day. You should see my woo. Listen, come on, be for real. Uh, quickly, musically, what's yeah. what in it for you? You said you hated that song, Melowin. I don't know why you hated. Joey, why would you say that? Okay, listen. The I don't hate it. It's just that. Joey, <laughs> how would you ask that? Now I'm gonna tell the truth, right? Mm. I fear God and not men. Um. It's not a song that I would prefer to be on, then but I am. Get on it? I got on it because for a very long time, I've been doing things for Juzi. Mm -hmm. Sometimes trading my voice for money, sometimes for free. 
Like I would do like his backup stuff in studio, mm-hmm. the voices, the voices and stuff. And this Nello one, I think, was actually a a backup performance. It wasn't even like a, a feature. Thing. Yeah. Because I remember you guys performed at the uh, uh, convention center. Yeah, that's, that's, when, that's also, what happened. Also, everybody got crazy about it. We're like, what? We want the yeah. song, and then it happened. And I'm not even. Okay. I'm sorry. Listen, it's a good my song. camera guy's gonna kill me. We're out of yeah, time. Yeah, I'm so sorry. Um, oh, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Please, so continue. <laughs> can't say no more. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So, so, so now that we can continue, yeah. Let's talk about your relationship now. Are you seeing anyone? <sighs> okay. Uh, am I seeing someone? You say? Mm. No. Whoever you is, <laughs> you don't matter. No, I'm not seeing anyone. Mm. Um, I'm not seeing anyone. Let's just put it at that. But why do you have to think about it? I'm thinking about it because... Because... <laughs> why am I thinking about I'm I'm trying to think. Um, You're trying to think of a lie. No, I'm trying to think no, of why I'm thinking watching. about it. I'm even, I, in fact... I respect him more than yeah. anybody in this room. So, Even that person who, who might be confused by the statement. Um, who's that person? I'm not going to tell you. Okay, give me a soup. Is it Samkele? No, Samkele is my friend. I don't know. No, because you always have this wrong idea of me and, 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 and musicians. But I don't so, like so, musicians. I, do I have a wrong impression about you in Bondo? I know you. Do Can I? we stop talking about Bondo? And you keep blushing? I know. <laughs> I'm not mm-hmm. blushing. It's just like, it's unimportant. You're mm. unimportant. Okay, no, I'm mm-hmm. sorry. I didn't mm-hmm. mean like that. Mm-hmm. I love you. You're my brother. And it's it's all love. But you, you smash. No. Okay. So, Quickly, who do you want to put on? Um, I, have this, put I have on? this little sister of mine who's been in my mind for mm-hmm. a very long time. Reta. Mm-hmm. She's a very beautiful young girl. I was supposed to perform with her. Vibes, the party that happened in convention center. She was supposed to back me happen. up. It didn't. It did happen, but I just didn't perform that day because of the time frame and whatnot. And whatnot. You, okay. Yeah, but they're gonna have a show. They did pay me. Pay me okay. very well, actually. They're gonna have a show where the people that didn't perform, look at another show like Lee, Lee, Gwenani, are gonna perform. And and and, I know what was my point in this. You were talking about. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now you distracted me. Right? I was waiting to go the next question after that. Crazy. Um, anyway, what's my question? I was question? talking about Sorry. you putting someone on. Oh, the tabile. Eh, me tuna to pavu na na mono. So what? What? Like, tell us about her. I would have to social check. Media. Yeah, I don't know her social media, but what? Uh-oh. What's her name? The tabile. That's all you know. That's all I know. But I mean, you don't know the same name. She's my little sister. She's my little sister's friend, and I adopted her as my. Okay, little guys, sister. we'll put her name in the credits. Yeah, then, shout like, out. Her in the yeah, credits. she's amazing. She's incredible. You still have beef she's with uh, Cuban links. I don't have beef. With no, you guys, you guys, you guys had like a lot. Yeah. See, another thing, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't have beef with but Cuban, Cuban links. links. Cuban links are you and Cuban links are not okay. I, if they're not okay with me, no, um, like no, like well, that's whole situation that I know about. Yo, what situ- Oh, that situation. Mm. Stand your ground, oh girl. Stand your ground. I think it's very important if you're trying to build a brand, of which I'm not trying to do that anymore. But if you're trying to build a brand, stand your ground and be firm in the principles and the parameters you've set for your brand. If write it down, even I would advise anyone to write it down. If you say. I fifty percent. I mean, fifty percent discount before performance. That should be a thing. Don't compromise it, and l- lest it'll it'll it won't go. Mm. If you if you. But if that's you, how you will send your invoices. Why do you guys send invoices? I'm, hey, I'm yo, I didn't even send invoices. In I'm my worried. in so my in my work. music. Let me just tell you real quick. In my musical uh uh career, that's not a career. Whatever. I, I never did that. People would just call me, hey, there's a show. Okay, and how much you got? Up we got 500 bucks for you, girl. I'm like, okay, let's go. So you just drop twat. No invoice, nothing. Nothing. So how do you sort of like calculate how much you've made? I don't call. I never. Any of that was never a thing for me. Like, Shucks. I'm, I'm need being to grow honest. In the music industry. That's what I'm saying. That's that's, that's okay. what I'm saying. Be very intentional about 
your career, brand, yeah. about your brand, yeah. you know? Yeah. Be very strict and very intentional about it. I wasn't able to do that because of my own. But whoever is trying to pursue music or any area in the music industry, be very strict and, and Make it a music business. treat yourself how people want to, how you want, want people, people to treat, treat you. you. Yeah, yeah. yeah, like yeah. you're doing. You're very, yeah. you're very professional in this area of your life. Hey, Shout out to you. Hey, pa, thank you so much. Yeah. And while well, I can very, smell them, like and, this and, coffee. And one thing that, that Bostan and Bomalume, in fact, Stan has always, has always mastered is Mchena Yaore. He's a celebrity. This stuff, for as long as you've known, Mm. You want you want to know how long I've known him? No, I'm saying you must say he's been maintaining that for as long as you've known him. For as long as I've known him, yeah. he's always he been somewhere. He started and, 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 and listen, I applaud him for that now. Same. But also when he started, he wasn't that strict about things. But now I think he saw that there's money in this as a true business. Yeah. Yeah. But he's anyway. still the same guy. I, and I know a lot of people that are like, oh no, he's so much the same guy. He's very much still the same. Listen, I don't know what that was. So I just decided to do that. Thank you so much for coming through. Yes, Ladies and gentlemen, you. we're out of here. Remember, comment, like, subscribe, do everything. Uh, let's you know keep it growing, keep it moving. Otherwise, own the day like a boss and keep bad. Yeah. Keep playing, so don't I'll... do drugs. Don't do drugs. Don't make no baby. Stop yeah. having sex. Stop it. <laughs> for real, it's not even funny. It's not funny. All the things I'm gonna hate you for this. They must. <laughs> I ain't even <laughs> making friends. I ain't your friends. Stop it. Guys, for have real. a good one. You're out. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Welcome to the